She's the gorgeous bubbly blonde with an Oscar on her mantle. And he's the world's biggest heartthrob thanks to those Twilight films you may have heard of. So you can thank the smart cookie that decided to pair Reese Weatherspoon with Robert Pattinson as the result is a classic Hollywood romance in Water for Elephants. I sat down with the stars to find out if any of that smouldering translated off-screen as well. I'm probably going to cop a lot for asking this question, but all the women I talked to, can you ask what it was like to kiss Robert Pattinson? <laughs> Every woman. Enjoyable, not difficult, not challenging. It's a, like, I'm not going to pretend it's not a weird job. It's a weird job. All the women I talk to, they're just like, I don't care if he's got a cold. I don't care if he's in a coma. <laughs> <laughs> Is he breathing? Does he have a pulse? I'll take it. Even then, questionable. Taji. Is this the, uh, the way elephants flirt? <laughs> Would you two like to be alone? <laughs> now, I heard uh, the actual one of the co-stars had a crush on you. The elephant. Okay, I, I keep hoping that some, like, someone else will say, like, it's like, one of the clowns. <laughs> one of the clowns, his name's Steve. He was an extra. He's he gonna, loves you. He's going to pick you up in a very tiny car, <laughs> take you out for dinner for cream pies and throw one in your face. She did like Rob a lot, though. She followed Rob around a lot. Was oh, sort of, really? Yeah, it was sort of sweet. She, he had all his um, scenes with her, and he was sort of her caregiver in the movie, and yeah. she would just kind of follow him around. You need to get off the train. Wait! punched a lot in the movie. Yeah. With the times of the director, you're like, can I just get another shot in? Like, uh, yeah, every single time. I get, I, get, I get beaten up like nine times because I was asking, I was like, like can I hit back, please? And he's like, no. I still look like such a pussy in it. With special effects to use so often these days, you may be surprised to know Reese performed all her own stunts. I was having the time of my life. It was really, really fun. Really? Yeah. I mean, I was scared at first because she's very tall. She's 12 feet tall and 9,000 pounds. And literally, if she steps one inch, to the left the wrong way, she can crush you. But like, I just slowly built up confidence and after about five months, we were able to do it. She's very calm. She's 45, She's she's been in more movies than Rob and I put together. She would rest her, her trunk on his knee. Oh really? It was really cute, yeah. You can't kind of do the same, you couldn't compete with that, could you? Just stroll up and try and put your nose on his kneecap and... I don't try to get between any woman and Rob Hadson. <laughs> it's just a recipe for disaster. <laughs> In the animal world, that's called presenting. Uh, Water for Elephants uh, is not only important for their well-being, it's also the name of the movie. It's in cinemas next Thursday, 12th of May. Look, I'll admit, guys, you saw my pose. I was trying to get a little bit of Robert Pattinson to rub off on me. And, um, Which when, bit? When he was... <laughs> This is a G-rated show. Now, in Sydney, uh, he was actually uh, at a press conference and a journo asked him about his romantic side and uh, what was the secret to that romantic success. Are you a romantic yourself? What's one of the most romantic things you've ever done in your life? <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. If Edward coughs on women, quite frankly, I'm hocking up loogies. Let it. We're going to take a break. We will be back in a moment. Woo!